Welcome to the channel. Thank you everybody for tuning in. Just a quick review for you guys today and uh, not much of a review, more of a showcase on a bracelet. I did mention a few weeks back that Steel Dive have started doing bracelets with their watches uh, and following my review on from the Aris 65 homage at the SD 1965, I also opted to get a Steel Dive SD 1971 or the Sumo homage just so I can review the bracelet, see if the bracelet is any good. Uh, as mentioned, in my previous reviews of this watch, I absolutely love this watch from Steel Dive. It is one of their better finished watches. Um, just great amount of quality on the actual watch case, dial hands, etc. Um, but just yeah, just want to see the bracelet because that is what the watch was severely lacking. Prices, uh, they have dropped quite a bit. So Steel Dive are uh, dishing these out for around £116, um, which is around $160. Now that doesn't fully makes sense to me uh because the rs65 is around 130 and this is 116 um so it, it really doesn't make sense how they're working the pricing out but you know it is what it is uh just to give you guys let's move the box out of the way sorry just to give you guys a quick one so while after watch i'll link any reviews um in the video that i've done of this watch already so the actual watch case itself is very incredible uh, and i've also done a comparison with the san martin sumo homage also um, now at that point in time i think uh the value for money option was a steel dive because case wise they are more or less exactly the same um the differences are in the dial hands as you can see on the bezel but again i'll link the review to the full comparison um now this video let's look at the bracelets uh, and let's see if that comparison still stands so the bracelet i will say is actually more or less exactly the same as the one on the aris 65 homage the sd1965 uh, you know you've got similar links actual exactly same construction um yes the bracelet feels quite light a bit flimsy um it is a bit rattly so by no means a premium bracelet um, you do have a taper from 20 mil down to 18 mil. Solid end links, solid links, and they are held together by split pins. And of course, you've got this poor uh, milled clasp that they, you know, adamant and insistent upon using. Your signage on the clasp, as I showed you guys before. And this is my problem with the bracelet. There's just too much play. Um, you know, it doesn't really feel. That's substantial it is quite light um i don't think it's even 316 l stainless steel um but you know 416 pounds can you complain possibly so um because the watch case is so much better is so good and they really have let themselves down with the bracelet i was expecting something just a bit better and you know what you can see here just look at that amount of movement from the second link that is just a bit too much but good news is they both do on either side you know articulate down the rs65 homage uh, actually one of the bracelet links was stuck due to poor finishing so you know qc aspect side you know it works there's nothing wrong with the bracelet uh, it's just a bit cheap to be honest but for the price can you complain as opposed to you know the sumo homage from san martin which is about 160 uh, pounds for around i'd say 220 30 dollars maybe um I don't know, honestly guys, this one's up to you. I would fork out the extra and go for this because just it's a better finished product um, and I do really like this watch. But having said that, if you're not too fussed about the bracelet, then no brainer, definitely go, go for this. Uh, so I'll leave the link in the description if you guys are interested. Uh, and I think it's fair to say, look, having looking, um, I think it is fair to say having seen two watches from Steel Live just recently with the bracelet options that uh, this is the standard going forward. This is what the bracelets are going to be like. Uh, so, you know, don't really have your hopes up for the bracelets, but it just does look just so much better on a bracelet. Wrist check, I'm wearing the 54 watch, 62 mass homage modded by myself. It's a cracking little watch. So yeah, guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video. Thank you.